I can tell you that I'm probably Mazur X and Mazur Renaissance biggest fan. It's phenomenal. When you think about it, it's absolutely phenomenal. Anything that I can do as a surgeon to be more efficient, more precise, and eliminate or reduce the risk for my patient is going to make my life easier. It's going to make, allow me to sleep better at night. The surgeon's still doing the surgery. These tools are just facilitating the plan, the efficiency, the precision, and the outcome. It, it, it will be the standard of care, no doubt about it. I'm in favor of going in a direction of eliminating manual error. I'm a big believer in the software. I don't think it's time wasted at all. Uh, it can be done any time, that's the beauty of it. You don't have to do it in the operating room when you're wasting OR time, which is what people worry about. Preoperative planning is critical. Coming to the operating room prepared. It's rehearsed, it's done, the team knows what I'm doing, I know what I'm doing, and the surgery just becomes that much more efficient. You know, there's no guesswork anymore. You plan your surgery in your office. The execution suddenly is not giving you any heartache anymore in the operating room because you know exactly where the screws are gonna go. I don't ever want to go back to a day where we're not preoperatively planning. Data is power. Data comes in, if you put that all together for a hospital system, for example, they could plan things with personnel, with equipment, with screw systems, maybe manage inventory a lot better. The, the amount of data that's being gathered goes much beyond my simple little operating room or my practice, but it goes um, towards you know, planning of how healthcare around spine is going to evolve. Uh, this goes beyond perhaps just placing an implant. I am absolutely anxious and eager to see what I say 15 years from now. Mazor X is, like I said, it's the, it's the next step.